Hey everyone, Rowan here. As someone who decided to be a fanboy on hard mode, I can say with 100% confidence that thigh highs are without doubt the greatest thing ever. Also known as programmer socks, thigh highs are pretty much exactly what you think they are. Socks that go up past your thigh. But surely it goes deeper than that, right? Such an elegant and beautiful creation that can cause so much euphoria in both the wearer and potential admirers. I personally consider them to be the apex of fanboy clothing. They can add so much to the outfit, and even potentially be the focal point of the outfit. But they can also be super subtle, like if you have to adhere to a strict dress code for a job, but you need a little boost of dopamine. BAM! Just wear them under your khakis and no one will suspect you. Secret agent! And of course, I can't forget to mention the naughty appeal, but as someone who's borderline ace, I don't really feel qualified to speak about that. So not only are they versatile, but they make the perfect gift. I don't know about the rest of you, but as an adult, I actually really like getting socks as gifts. Pretty much since I turned 18, the gifts I appreciate the most have always been socks, even when they weren't that highs. For instance, for our one year anniversary, my 13 out of 10 girlfriend got me a six pack of thigh highs and holy heck, they are so pretty. I feel so pretty when I wear them. I love them so much. <laughs> now, I mentioned in the beginning that I chose to be a femboy in hard mode. As you can tell by my deeper voice, I don't really do vocal training, and I was cursed with Jumanji leg hair. So keeping my legs shaved is very annoying, but that's where the thigh highs come in. Put them on and you can't even tell that there's leg hair there. In colder weather at least. I love my thigh high collection to death, but I live in a desert and wearing a pair in the summer is torture. I know the saying is beauty is pain, but I don't know if pain includes being soaked in your own sweat. And now as we enter the summer, and I retire my thigh highs to the drawer until temperatures lower again, I can only reminisce about the joy they brought me through the fall and winter. So I can't really segue into this all that well, but I just wanted to gush about some of the designs I've seen recently and 100% want to buy when it gets cl close to winter again. Hey, so editor Rowan here, uh, not all of these are going to be thigh highs, but uh... Yeah, it's my video and I do what I want. And spoiler alert, since I'm very trash, most of these are going to be animal themed. The live action Rowan here, right off the bat, you can see we have these just I, polar bear knee highs. They're just, ugh. Bears are just one of my favorite animals, so I, I immediately love these. We're gonna, oh, oh my god, permaids. Ah, cats. Ah, so cute. And of course, you know, foxes. Get out of the foxes. We got the best trans pride icon. More cats. My girlfriend would probably steal this from me. But yeah, no, they're too cute. I've always wanted a corgi, so. Ah, my, my heart. My heart, I love these. I will, I'm, it's taking every ounce of, every ounce of willpower to not just immediately buy all of these. We got more cats, just the cat tails. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that they have a little face. What is this gonna do? Oh, that's actually really cool. I did not realize that they came in other colors. Oh. I will 100% be getting the tabby though when they come back in stock. Or is that tabby? No. Um, <laughs> I, I don't know cat breeds, I just know orange. <laughs> We got more foxes because it won't be complete without it. With that big bright tail, what does the color change do? Is it just... Okay, so it's literally just the different change. <clears throat> In the words of Sir Daniel Sexbang, Release the Kraken! Oh my god, that was bad. But yeah, release the Kraken. I love these. I don't... <laughs> I mean, we got Burb. Burbs are cool. <laughs> Uh, more more cats. More cats are always good. Uh, I love them. Um, I was gonna try and make a witty card joke, but I don't know. So um, check. <laughs> I love Reese's Pieces. They're probably one of my favorite candies. So. Uh, oh my god, I just noticed the name. <laughs> Eggs for Barts! 
Speaking of Bart. <laughs> yes. Yes. Everyone knows that RGB gives you 10% bonus FPS in your games. So why not wear them on your feet as well? I want to believe it, Mothman. I really do. This is beautiful. I want 50 pairs of these. Preferably in the tie-dye color. Same goes with these. These just look... Oh my god, the eye. <laughs> I, I feel like there's a joke about um, Cthulhu in here somewhere, but... Nah, that probably would have gone better with the squid. Now, pretty much all of what we've just looked at came from a website called Sock Dreams, and I cannot recommend them enough. I bought, like, six pairs from them now, and they just always work out so well. I'm 5'11", and I've had issues with other socks I bought elsewhere that were, quote, thigh highs, end quote. Barely making it past my knee. Not from Sock Dreams. I'm not sponsored by them, but, uh, but, but low-key, I would love to be sponsored by them one day. I just really like this company, and they always have such great products. So if you've been on the fence about getting a pair or 30, take this as a sign to buy some. Until next week, I've been Rowan, and I hope you all have a great day. I personally consider them to be the fem- be the femboid. <laughs>